Hi there, my name's Liam, and today I was wondering if it would be okay if I could take you on a journey. W would you like to come? You would? To infinity and beyond. Oh. This is Mars. It has unbreathable air, toxic soil, extreme radiation, low gravity, a thin atmosphere, super cold surface temperatures, and here's why I think it would be great to live here. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Mars is just a whole bunch of sand. How on earth is, <coughs> wait, actually, how on Mars is that entertaining? Let me take you on a little trip and I'll show you. These are some of the biggest sand dunes in New Zealand and surprisingly, they quite closely approximate what your backyard would look like on Mars. Why is this great? One word, sandboarding. Wait, is that one word? So the idea is slide down the sand dune on a board. Okay, three, two, one. Oh God. Oh. 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 Yes, Oliver, yes. Oh, God. Oh, capsize. Tragic. Oh, oh. Actually sick. Okay, I'm probably running the Mars jokes a little bit dry at this point. <laughs> Dude, that's the Mars joke in itself. Because there's no water. Oh! <laughs> Mars is just a whole bunch of sand, right? Actually, wrong. It's a business opportunity. What do people need? Food. More specifically, pizza. So I open a pizzeria. Liam's out of this world pizza because it's actually out of this world. It doesn't matter if the pizza sucks, because it's the only one there. Hello everybody, welcome to Liam's Out of This World Pizzeria. The place where the pizzas taste just as good as the name sounds. That's not going to be my name. Today I'm going to be making our signature dish. Here's what you're going to need. A tray, a pizza base, a Mars bar. <laughs> Come on, that's pretty funny. The pizza is in the oven. I repeat, the pizza is in the oven. Oh my dude. 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 Oh. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing here. I'm saving that for later, dude. So gravity on Mars is about 38% of the gravity on Earth. Why is that great? For the most part, it's actually not. It's, it's quite bad for your muscles and, and bones. But apart from that, safety. Let's say you're on the roof and you fall off. Oh geez, that really hurt since I was on Earth. Falling off a roof on Mars though, is basically just like falling off your bed, which in theory, <sighs> no, that does still hurt a little bit. Or let's say there's a boulder and it's coming straight for you. On Earth, you would have this long. But on Mars, you have this long. Oh, gee, look at that boulder coming towards me. I should probably get out the way. See? Or let's say you're trying to escape lava. Instead of being able to jump this high, you'll be able to jump this high. Oh. And that brings us to the end of the video, my friends. You know, there's nothing like watching a Martian sunset at the end of the day, even if it is blue and a little bit dark. Let me know if you didn't like this slightly different style of video, I guess. Is it slightly different? I don't know. Thank you all very much for watching. I will see you very, very soon. Peace out. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's, what's on my peace out symbol? Oh, snap. And bye-bye. This is the most exercise Oliver has done 
in the last 10 years.